Hello viewers, I welcome you all from HLTF Tech channel and today we will talk about the uh, resources group in um, Dynamics 365. For example, if we go into the settings and here we go into the business management, we, we have this component that is resource group. Resource group is an, uh, an important component in which you add new groups and new members to existing groups for service scheduling update group information and delete groups or group members those groups are very important in your field service management module in which you are going to give the services and uh, for that services uh, let's say these are uh, different services and for that services uh, for giving that services it is very mandatory that you assign some uh, as, uh, resources that are available in your uh, organization so for that purpose First of all, we have to go into the security and in security, uh, we have to, if I go into the security here, in security, I have various users here. For example, I have uh, three users that are HR manager, HR payroll manager and HR deputy manager. And uh, if I go into their uh, details, Let's say if I go into the uh, security and I go into the teams, I can see that these users, I have grouped them in a team of HR managers team. So HR manager teams is the team in which uh, these three users are there. And I want that whenever an interview is to be taken, that is, uh, let's say I want to schedule a service which I want that whenever I want to take interviews of some new newly inducted candidates I must <coughs> include this team these three uh, members of this team will also be the component of that uh, interview team so for that purpose I go into uh, business management and in business management I go into the resources groups and I'm going to click the new one interview members of HR okay I'm going to name it as uh, interview members of HR who will be the essential members of interview team whenever I'm going to take the interview of any newly inducted candidates <clears throat> I will click save and in that uh, you can say resource group I am going to add the resource here you can type uh, add uh, different type of resource for example you can add the facility you can add the user uh, right now I'm going to add the team so I'm going to add this team so what I'm going to do I'm going to select it and include it and I'm going to add it if, uh, uh, furthermore we are not going to connect anything as a role just I want that this team must be uh, an asset of field service management in which whenever I configure the service these uh, members are included <clears throat> so I'm going to save and close it and this resource group has been created here now if I go again into the business management and services I, and if I go to add a new service here so I'm going to say let's say <coughs> interview interviews of new candidates i'm just giving you an example you can uh, schedule any service that service may be your uh, service of uh, maintenance service it can be of your scheduled service of your uh, products for example uh, you can schedule the service of your products uh, after every five years for, oh, sorry five months you can uh, schedule your resource group to go and so uh, give services to for the maintenance or any other thing let's see so I, I'm just giving you an example here so this service is its default duration is let's say it's for five hours start a activities start after every you can say it starts after every one day I'm going to schedule it and the each time will be 8 a.m. so after that uh, I'm going to save it 
so that it is saved successfully okay uh, the service requires some resources to be created so I have configured a add uh, resource group here so I'm going to click on the resource group so I'm going to select it I'm going to add it and then I'm going to save it so uh, in this way a resource group has been created and this uh, service will be for five hours and it will <coughs> rescheduled you can also select this and you can uh, activate it or deactivate it as per your requirement so uh, I'm going to activate it right now and this service is now active and for that purpose we can also have some different types of workflows for example there may be a workflow that whenever you activate this service uh, inter, uh, emailing message to all of the members of your uh, uh, HR manager team may be generated and go into their email box and intimate them that you uh, are required to reach uh, for interview at XYZ location on that time for taking the interviews similarly you can uh, define as many services as you want here you can schedule them you can link them uh, with some uh, workflows for intimation etc uh, and these are the components of uh, services as well as uh, you can say resource manager so i thank you all for watching this short video